All right, in this tutorial, what we want to do is go over uh, how you can modify some of the settings in Moodle. Now, when you first log into Moodle, you'll notice that it has sort of this, this light brown, grayish look. Uh, a lot of people don't find this to be very interesting. They want to change it. Uh, we also talked last time about how you can have either a weekly outline or a topics outline. And you'll notice there is a default number of weeks or topics in a, every Moodle course. Now, a lot of times, three of the things that people are going to want to change are the look and feel, the number of topics that exist in a course, and whether they have a weekly or topic outline. So what we're going to do is go over the settings and show you how to do that. Now you'll also remember, I told you these are blocks, and there's one block that's particularly important if you're an instructor, and that's the administration block. So what we're going to want to do is go to the settings uh, block or the settings link from the administration block. So I'm going to go to administration, I'm going to click on settings. And, sorry about that bad link for a little, um, for a second there. What you'll notice right here is uh, the course settings. Generally what I recommend that you do is ignore these first three links. Uh, those, those are going to be things that the Moodle administrator is going to automatically fill in for you, so that when you're not going to, uh, you're not going to have to worry about those. This is the course description. You can add a course description there. And this area here, from format down to uh, force theme, are going to be the settings that you're really going to worry about. Now, right here, what you'll notice is you have um, the format options. And the two most popular options are weekly format and topics format. Like I said, the weekly format is going to add dates to every single block, or not block, but every single module. And the topics are going to just display them without any dates. You can also have a social format, that, but that's used mostly for people that are going to want to have uh, discussions primarily. Now, if at any point in Moodle you get confused about what one of the options are, you'll notice they have these really nice uh, question mark icons. If you click that, what it's going to do is uh, open up a window and it's going to give you a little bit of help. Sometimes this help is very useful, sometimes it's uh, not particularly useful, but it can't hurt to go and look. So you'll see in this case it tells you the social format is oriented around one main forum and that social forum, which appears on the course homepage, is useful for situations that are more freeform. So this will give you a more by-the-book explanation of each individual thing. But for your course, mostly if you're teaching at NJIT, I recommend that you use either a weekly or a topics layout. Now I told you sometimes you're going to notice that you're going to need more weeks or more topics. This is particularly true when you get your first course out of the box or something like 10 topics or weeks and you're going to need to increase this number. So you just go to the number of weeks or topics this case you'll see I'm going to raise it to 18. Here you have your course start date. This is the area where you can set the first day of class. If you're teaching a face-to-face -face class, for example, and the week starts on uh, the first class is on uh, Tuesday, you could set the course start date for that Tuesday and everything will be set accordingly. Now uh, the next item that you're really going to want to look at is the show gradebook to students. If this is set to yes, that means that students are going to be able to see the gradebook. They only see their own grades. Um, they'll only see grades that you add. But if you're ever thinking about using the gradebook or just using it once just to distribute one set of grades for a quiz or something, I recommend that you have this set to yes. Now show activity reports. That's something that you could turn to yes if you want them to see uh, their activity reports. This will let them know how many times they've logged in what pages they've gone to. Here you can specify the maximum upload size so that um, if you're just having students submit documents primarily, um, Excel spreadsheets, Word documents, 20 megabytes is going to be plenty for them. And this here is something that's pretty nice and that's force theme. By default I showed you how it's sort of a gray uh, looking uh, layout. What you can do is change that to a number of different uh, themes that are available by default in Moodle. The autumn theme is one that people tend to like. They think that it works pretty well. So you'll notice if I put it to autumn, it can be uh, set and it's going to change the look and feel. Now the enrollment, the uh, enrollment um, notification, the expiry notification, the groups, 
availability language. You can ignore all of that. That's all stuff that you don't have to worry about that's set. Like I said, you're just concerned with those, those key little block up at the top. Um, and what I'm going to do is hit Save Changes now. And you'll notice that uh, the whole look and feel changes. It has a completely different look, which is nice. Some people like this better. At any given time, you can go in and change it. You can change the theme at any given time. You can change it from weeks to topics at any point in the semester. And um, everything on the fly will, will just reorganize and work. Now you'll notice down here, it added two blank topics for me. So I can have these topics and um, I can go and continue to edit them and add on. So this concludes our uh, tutorial that was going to explore the settings tab of the administration block. And in the next one, what we're going to do is show you how to um, go in and add uh, resources or add activities and how to modify the contents for a particular week. So hopefully this is, this is helpful and you'll continue to visit our future tutorials.